I just want you guys to know that when I talk about stuff, I talk about things from experience. And some of my experiences are good and some of them are bad. And then a lots of a lots of them are thinking experiences that you know that we could we should be able to sit down and have logical conversations about differences that we have. Right. Um, so I was tagged in in this video. Did you get the picture from it, Mo? Mm -hmm. I was tagged in this video right here. And because they was like, this has T.S. Master written all over it. Play okay. the video. Let's talk about it. In America, you need to learn it. Learn English. Learn it. You get money in America. This is if you get money in America, learn English. I don't give a fuck. Learn it. Learn it. You riding on the roads, learn English. Learn English. Learn English. Learn English. Learn English. Learn English. This ain't your fucking country. This ain't your fucking country. Learn English. Learn English. This ain't your fucking country. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you, boy? You better learn English. Hey, hey. Learn English. Now, personally, I feel that this was extremely unnecessary. It was. That was that. That was that was to uh to an extreme that's just not necessary at all. It wasn't. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it's because you really have to look at that. The guy is working. When we got into this kerfuffle the oh, other day, now now listen, this is what happened to the place, right? Oh, yes. Let me show you. Hold on. So the place has been shut down. Now, you want my honest opinion, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> they did what they were supposed to have did. They did what they supposed to have did, bitch. They came the motherfucker to the, the community, came together and wore that place out. Shut and my man. thing is, it was overkill because why did you get over in that person's face? Like, you didn't have to do that and screaming that this is not... Because technically, this ain't our country either, bitch. Yeah. I mean, speak, speak the truth. Speak the truth. If you want to keep it all the way a being... This ain't even our motherfucking country either. Right. Mo, do you have that other video? I think I need you to put that in there. What you asked me that I want to talk about? Yeah. You want me to put it in there? Yeah, I do. Okay, hold on. Technically, this is not our country. This is not our country either, bitch. This is not. And it's just, you. there's a way that you really just don't have to do that. I do feel that in this country, we have lots of, of language lots of language barriers here mm -hmm. that are that are hindering us from being able to you know really communicate with each other mm -hmm. i think that the bilingual barrier needs to be upheld on both sides i can agree with that just for me just for me and i i think that the bilingual barrier at the the uh excuse me the bilingual barrier needs to be held up on both sides i think that we have been living here for a very long time and America has been known to be a melting pot but I think that we both if we're going to be real about the situation I think that we both that there's this um, there should be a learning of another language on both sides I think that that's what we I think that 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 would help us be able to communicate right now last time I had this conversation they uh what is it they label me xenophobic because I said I think that people should learn, you know, some English, some basic English, some basic English. And I do think that, bitch, we need to learn some basic Spanish. Basic. At least counting. At least some type of way that we could communicate with each other, you know. Uh, the people drug me, went through this. The United States don't have a, a, a telling me that the United States don't have a, a um, official an language. official language. And I learned I learned lots of things in that conversation. I was like, oh, okay, got it. 
Got it. Yeah, there was, I, I didn't know that either. I didn't. We, I didn't know. You don't have it. You don't have the video, Mo? I'm doing. It's going in right now. Yeah. Um. You said, hold on. Not every single person. Hold on. I'm looking. Not every single person. Hold on. Let me go. Uh. uh that's right, Joe Dreamy. I think that we should learn basic communication in each other's language. I, I don't. What What is wrong with us being multilingual? What is wrong with all of us being multilingual? Everything. Nothing. What's wrong with that? Yeah, we we'll, we can play it from there, not from the phone. We'll play it from there. Uh, hold on. Somebody has a question. Hold on. Oh, sorry. Where was it? Yeah. You put you got the video in there? Mm -hmm. All right. We'll talk about that that second part. Um let me see. Where is it? I took Spanish in elementary school. Okay, River Rainwater. Let's go out to River Rainwater. River Rainwater said, no, we as Americans should, should be forced to learn another language in our own country. There are no other place in the world where you can get away with that. Well, uh, I don't think that there's no other place in the world that's uh, actually being labeling themselves as the melting pot. I don't think that there's other there are many other places in the world that's labeling the United States has labeled labeled itself the melting pot. So because we had that big debacle the other day, there was so much stuff that I learned. And I'm not going to say that my views like completely changed because I didn't have bad views, but I learned a lot of things in in. That was the conversation in the conversation, like right. for those that wasn't trying to berate me or of those people that wasn't trying to. uh call me xenophobic or whatever. Mm -hmm. I still feel that there should be basic English learn to break down some of the learn uh, some of the communication uh barrier in between us, but I also feel that we can learn another language too. I think that the that the responsibility of communication lies on both people involved. Right. So do you, so do you think that um Spanish should be like a mandatory uh, class in school. Uh, I think multi languages should be like a man a mandatory course. If oh. if 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 you as the United States have deemed your this country as the melting pot of the world, if you have deemed the United States a melting pot of the world. I do believe that it is your duty to enforce multi-language in the school system because we're there's so many people that are coming. Coming, right. So it should be mandatory. If you're going to say that you've opened up the place and everybody is, a, this is the land of the free and the home of the brave and everybody should be able to get an opportunity, it should be enforced. And that goes both ways. That goes both ways. That there should be learning courses both ways. I, I can agree with you that. Because I think I told you before when I was in when I was going to school in Nigeria, we had to learn multiple languages. We had to learn uh the native language, we had to learn English, we had to learn French, we had to learn German. Um, I believe that was it. But yeah, you had and you had to pass them. You can't you couldn't just take them. You actually had to pass them because if you didn't pass all of your subjects, they held you back. So. Well, there's so many people. It's so the comments are flying in. They are. It's uh, Jessica Green said, I believe that if you're in America, you should speak English. Um, when they stole us from our country, we had to learn the language. There is no catering to people who spoke who spoke a different language. I feel that English should be mandatory. Well, Jessica, we're black. And um, we didn't, I mean, I was going to, didn't come over here for, uh, by free will. And either. that's what she's saying. Right. And we're black. And so what, what is Verling saying? Maddie, please stop this conversation. You just refuse to get it and it's painful to witness. What, what am I refusing to get? Right. I, I don't understand what what is it that I'm refusing to get. 
what what is it that's being refused to be gotten? This is this is a classic thing of someone hearing it from from the side that they just don't feel that they agree with. Again, what did you not what did you hear that was painful? That was painful. I don't know, I don't understand it. Some people just talk the talk. I don't get it. I'm confusing. ¿Cómo se dice en español confuse? <laughs> ¿En qué español? ¿Cómo se dice confuse en español? Porque no, no, porque no sabes. ¿Cómo se dice en español confuse? Because I'm very confused on how I'm not trying to understand anything. And what is it? Con, con, con no entiendo. No entiendo. Oh, con, Confundida. Confundi con confundido. 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 Right. I'm going to learn some Spanish. Yes. No entiendo. I don't understand. All right. So again, what I'm stating is I understand that everyone is writing that uh, blah, blah, blah. Back to what I was saying. When I looked at that video and they were tagging me in this and saying this has T.S. Madison written all over it, I was like, no, this does not have T.S. Madison written over it because T.S. Madison would never, would never have done anything like that or T.S. Madison would have never on any day supported anything like that because no. that is not this gentleman's fault. And it, it is also not the fault of the country has opened the, opened the place up and said that this is the melting pot. This is the land of the free and this is the this is this is where people can come to get new starts from all over the place. Right. There are people here that don't speak Spanish. I feel that it should be learned to speak Spanish. It should be learned to speak French. It should be learned to speak other languages and to especially when you are allowed you are allowing people to come from different countries right. to come in and get a life here and you know there are already people here then it should be it, it should be mandatory for this stuff to be taught to it should be a mandatory part of the curriculum i can agree i can agree so that, that more so that so many american people won't be over here feeling the way like this guy felt like these people feel like okay well you know that this is going on and then you see american people over there feeling this way but i also feel that bilingual should be on both sides. I think that the, being able to be able to communicate with people should be something on both sides. We should be able to communicate with each other. I don't understand how someone is still getting in their feelings or getting in a space of me of saying this. And it's just like, I'm being some type of way. So I don't get, I just don't understand it. And I, I probably I'll, I'll never understand it from that from that perspective but, because <laughs> but I speak some Spanish. But I, the thing is that I don't get is if you can't agree to the fact that both sides or that the country in general should be able to at least be able to have like a casual conversation with somebody, regardless of the language. If you can't agree with that, then what do you think of like how are you expect the country to move forward and for people to work together if they can't communicate with each other uh so it doesn't make sense for your people to be upset when somebody says hey both sides should be able to learn the language so we'll be able to communicate i mean i would think people will want to get along with each other so i would think i i would think so too you know when i was in school and because I'm from Miami, uh, we have a lot of Spanish speakers. We have a lot of Latin American people there. We have a lot of Haitian American. So it was my duty for me to, le even, to even just learn how to count. It was, it was what I wanted to do. I wanted to learn how to even count. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, seis, sept, huit, neuf, dix. At least one through ten. Right, right. That was English. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, sept, sept, huit, neuf, dix. That's three different languages, bitch. <laughs> three different one through tens. 
<laughs> that's two. Well, that's three more than some people. That's three different one through motherfucking tens right there. Because some people can't speak. Some people from this country can't speak English. <laughs> that's three different one through tens. Right. So I do my part. I do my part. That's three different ones through motherfucking tens right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, seis, sept, huit, neuf, dix. Bitch, I even want to learn sign language. God damn it. <laughs> Look, I've, I've watched some of them, sign, uh, some of those people that do sign language at these uh, concerts, at these music concerts. They be getting it in. I want to learn sign language. It in. Bitch, I want to go back to school to learn sign motherfucking language. Bitch, I want to know. So you can cuss All people I out. Is this. Exactly. That's what I'm about to say. I so you can cuss know people more out. Than just this. <laughs> you want to cuss people out. I want to know. Answer. I can cuss them out like this, bitch. <laughs> I want to learn more than motherfucking that. <laughs> <laughs> bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I want to learn more than just doing that, Mo. Mother, you know. You got to start from somewhere, though. You do have to start from somewhere, and they, you know what they say: the best way to learn something is to learn the bad stuff first. So you, you on the right track? Yeah, you on the right track. Just keep it going. I'm. I, I, this is what I. It's because I, I. I want to know more. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. My thing is, it's the people that are that are that feel some type of way towards me. Even when I even when I have learned, I I told you I learned. I said, hey, guys, I've learned that the United States does not have an the, the English is not the is not the official language of the United States. It's not. Right. It is not the official language of the United States. It's, it is the de facto, and it's widely seventy some percent. It's, it's widely used. It's the, it's the most widely used, but it's not official here. Right. So, again, you say Google Translate goes a long way. Yes. And Google Translate works in two different, in both hands. Hello? Hello. Hi. Google Translate works in both, both hands. It can work in my hand. And, Mo, if you didn't understand me, it can work in yours. Am I correct? Yes, it can. So I just, I don't understand what is the reason why people are trying to stab me, maim me, shoot me, drag me, because I want all of us to have to be multilingual. Because when we went to Spain, you were having a whole well, conversation with the, uh, with the cab driver. I was when we got, yeah, now more we didn't, well, yeah, okay. So we landed in Spain. The cab driver, the one that we did get. Yeah. <laughs> the one cab driver that we did get to drive us from uh, the airport to our hotel, mm -hmm. we were in the full conversation and everybody in the car was looking. Mo was looking. <laughs> I was. I had the translator. Mo my had the translator. I'm like, move the translator. <laughs> me, and the, me and the guy, we just talking. Right. And when we got into spaces where we couldn't, where we couldn't uh, understand each other, he pulled out his translator. Yep. And we had ours in the back, and we had a. It was peace. Yeah. And everybody, and it was it was actually a great conversation. That and he was like, "Bitch, I want it." Is, if he said, "If y'all need a ride anywhere, well, I'll take it." Now we kept his number. We did. We did. And we couldn't get a hold to him no more. <laughs> well, we did a little bit, but it was just the time it was off. Right. And then you know we didn't we didn't cope we didn't go back to uh Madrid. Well, we you know we were at Madrid when we started off, and then we you know we ended up in Barcelona by the time that thing ended. So yeah. Now we were in Madrid, we were in Spain and we couldn't get a cab because we were black. Yeah. There was that one time I did get a cab, but then when when he saw all when he saw a whole bunch of black people coming to his to his cab. He's like, mm -mm. he said no. He said, mm -mm. he said, I gotta go. He said, mm, I gotta go. He said, he gotta go. <laughs> he said, he gotta go. He did. That's what he said. <laughs> and we were in Spain, and we couldn't get a cab. We we were almost stuck for a couple of hours, but near the beach yep. because we were black. 
<laughs> Say it again. Because we were black Americans. <laughs> yes. Not only were we black, we were American. We were black and American. <laughs> In Ibiza. <laughs> oh, yeah. Barcelona. We were in Ibiza and Barcelona. We were black and mm -hmm. American mm -hmm. in Ibiza and motherfucking Barcelona, Barcelona. And we could not get a cab. <laughs> <laughs> no one wants to hear this. Nobody wants to hear this. This don't this, nobody don't want to hear this. Mm -mm. But we could not get a cab. And it wasn't like they cabs were full or they had anybody in them either. And we were very much so. We had to go and remove our black pictures <laughs> from the from the app from <laughs> our apps. <laughs> we had to remove our black pictures pictures from our app. from our app mm. and once we removed the black pictures from our app people started responding yep. and then after they started responding when they pulled up on us they yeah. were like no <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. that's exactly it some of them didn't even stop some of them will some of them will pull up and they saw black people coming they'll go right they'll they were like right back off. no no we spent 10 days in Europe. Yep. We spent 10 days in Europe. And in this in the whole grand scheme of things, we collectively said we don't have to return. We were okay. <laughs> yes. Mom, we said we good. I need you to text Legra the uh the link to come in. Okay. Yeah, we said we were good. We said we were okay. I've seen enough of Europe. I've seen enough. Thank you. Good, and it, we may all. What did what did Jeffrey Jeffrey say? <laughs> Thank you for coming. You may all go home now. Good night. <laughs> <laughs>